Hey everybody, it's Ryan the Scavenger. Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we have two cool license plate editions that I got today. Um, one from Tom Rayburn, a U.S. Navy sailor. I put cards on people's uh, windows and asked them to send me plates after they've expired. And Tom had my card for over a year and he finally called me back when his plate expired and brought this in. So check out that story. And then finally, uh, my good buddy, uh, Joe Dickmeyer, brought me in, or mailed me, I should say, a uh, former military plate, and we'll check that out very briefly. So again, thanks everybody for uh, checking out my videos. Enjoy the video. Okay, everybody. On the left is uh, electrician's men's mate, second class petty officer, Tom Rayburn, uh, that lives near Kearney. And as I mentioned in the intro, I put my business card on his car and he called me back almost a year later after I put it on his car in the VA parking lot and said that he had new uh, Navy plates and he wanted to know if I still wanted them. And of course, you know what my response was, heck yes, I do. And so he came over and brought them to me. And here's a little info about his bio that I thought it was important to share as I always write on the back of the plates. And again, I always like to write on the back of the plates. And so Tom served in the Navy from 1967 to 1972. He went to Recruit Chain of Command, San Diego, California, then EMA school, then on to the USS Westchester, Westchester County, LST 1167, then Naval Hospital, where he was TAD, where he was uh, injured for a while, then to NIS Intel, Yakuska, Japan, and then Coronado, California boat unit, and then on to Guam. Um, man, he has a fascinating story about being on board the Westchester County, and uh, I'll share that here in a minute as uh, we have a look at his ship. So here's the uh, picture of the ship. Again, the USS Westchester County 1167 whole number, known as the West Co. On November 1st, 1968, the Westchester County was anchored on the muddy Maithau River, upstream from the Vung Tau, South Vietnam. At 3.22 in the morning, two massive explosions ripped through the starboard side, killing 25 service members and wounding another 22. The Navy's greatest single incident combat loss of life during the Vietnam War. Viet Cong swimmers had placed two mines on the starboard side. It could have been much worse. The tank deck of the old LST was filled with all varieties of ammunition and ordnance. Vessels tied up in, and in the vicinity of the Westchester County were loaded with fuel. It was only the immediate actions and the courage of the crew they avoided a catastrophic disaster and a sinking of the ship. The Westchester County was patched up and it limped back to its home port in Yokosuka, Japan, where repairs were eventually made to it and it returned back to duty. I had to share that story. I, I just found that fascinating that uh, Tom was on board when that happened. Uh, I used to be a history teacher, so it always comes out in me and I like to share a little bit of uh, historical information, especially uh, people from my uh, home area of Nebraska. So I hope you all enjoyed that. So my license plate uh, people here that enjoy the license plate content, this is an updated look at my Navy ratings and whole numbers and other Navy related uh, plates that I have there. Uh, if you look at the third row down, you'll see the ADC retire. That's the beginning of the ratings. And then you'll see the EM two there on the second page. So that is an updated look at what that looks like. And real quick, this is the very super rare Nebraska former military vehicle plate that is uh, put on old military vehicles. Uh, you just do not see very many of these. Uh, They're super rare. I've only seen like two or three of them in my uh, years of collecting. So, uh, Old Joe Dickmeyer from Fremont hooked me up with one of those today. 
And here is a quick look of an updated section for all of the Nebraska type plates. I hope you enjoyed that. Before you leave, make sure you smash that like and subscribe button. Leave some comments and watch some more videos. Man, we're really making a lot of progress up to 158 subscribers now. Uh, thank you all for sharing and giving shout outs to the page. I really appreciate it. Hey, everybody, take care and have a nice weekend.